A hundred years ago, Camilo Golgi, does anybody remember the name Golgi from high school? The Golgi complex, the Golgi stain. Camilo Golgi is in Italy, and he is a neurologist, and he's looking at the brain, and they don't know 110 years ago what the brain's really made up of. Is it a bunch of cells, like the cells in our body, or is it this vast network of fibers? And he puts a stain onto the brain tissue, silver oxide, and something miraculous happens that we still to this day do not fully understand. Some neurons expose themselves and arose out of the brain tissue with, in relief, in contrast to the back that stayed dark. Why some and not others, no one knows. And yet, because of this staining, we began to see 110 years ago a single neuron arising out of this lump of brain. Now, what is mindfulness? Mindfulness is looking at our mind. And what's the silver oxide? What's the staining ingredient that allows us to see more clearly what's arising in our mind? The breath? And so mindfulness creates the opportunity to apply ourselves intentionally a way of experiencing the moment, bringing awareness to, for example, the breath, the most common way, so that we can begin to see the thought arising out of the mind, the way Golgi saw the neuron arising out of the brain. Now we're talking about mind and brain, consciousness, because it's consciousness that chooses to intend to bring awareness to your breathing.